let's read the question the question says that a bullet of mass 10 gram moving horizontally with a velocity of 400 meter per second strikes a wooden block of mass 2 kg which is suspended by a light inextensible string of length 5 meter as a result the center of gravity of the block is found to rise a vertical distance of 10 centimeter the speed of the bullet after it emerges out horizontally from the block will be so we will solve this question first of all we will see what will be the key concept used to solve this question the key concept that will be used to solve this question will be conservation of energy conservation of energy so we will leave conservation of energy to solve this question now first of all we will see what is the situation that is given in the question suppose this is a in a, this is a wooden block that has a mass of 2 kg this the mass of the wooden block is 2 kg and it is suspended by a light inextensible string and the length of the string that is 5 meter so this distance is 5 meter now what happens a bullet that has a mass of 10 gram this bullet has a mass 10 gram and that is moving with velocity 400 meter per second that strikes the wooden block and due to this strike the wooden block rises a vertical distance of 10 centimeter so suppose this is the final position of the wooden block this is 2 kg and this distance is 10 centimeter that is 0 0.1 meter this distance is 0 0.1 meter and from here the velocity of wooden block will be v1 and that of the bullet changes to v2 so now we will see the block rises 10 centimeters so we will conserve energy here the wooden block has kinetic energy that is equal to zero or let us conserve energy for total so we have by conservation of energy potential energy at this maximum height we are calling this as maximum height so potential energy at maximum height that will be equal to kinetic energy at bottom at bottom of block so here maximum height potential energy will be equal to m1 gh m1 is the mass of the wooden block and h is the height vertical height raised that is 0 0.1 that will be equal to half m1 into v1 square so half m1 into v1 square now v1 is the velocity of the wooden block so m1 is 2 kg or we will cancel the m1 from both the side g is 10 meter per second square h is 0 0.1 meter that will be equal to half into v1 square or solving for v1 from here we will have v1 is equal to 1.4 meter per second Okay, yes, V1 1.4 meter per second. Now, U1 is the initial velocity of the bullet ball and V2 is the final velocity of the bullet. Okay? So, now we use conservation of momentum. So, by conservation of momentum, we will have M2 U2 is equal to M1 V1 plus m2 v2 because initially kya tha ye rest mein tha theek hai initially ye rest mein tha and finally iska velocity v1 hai aur iska velocity bullet ka velocity v2 hai so we will have m2 into u2 this is u2 u2 is 400 meter per second ye u2 hai theek hai this is the initial velocity of bullet so we will have m2 is 1 by 1000 multiplied by sorry m2 kitna mass of bullet that is 10 grams so that is 10 by 1000 into u2 is 400 meter per second that will be m1 is 2 into 
v1 we have found 1.4 plus m2 each again 10 by 1000 and v2 we have to found uh, we have to find v2 so solving for v2 from here we will get v2 is equal to 120 meter per second so the correct option will be option a 120 meter per second so this will be the final answer hope you all understood it well best of luck